Hi guys, welcome to the village. My name is Bonnie. I create content around careers, education with a dose of reality check. Today we are looking at I'm a pay sleep, I'm a pharmacist, people who are working in the pharmacy industry. Some of them are quite um, qualified pharmacists and some of them are pharmacist assistants. Okay, guys, let's start with the pharmacy manager. Okay. Let's see. Hi, Bonnie. Uh, below is my pay slip as a pharmacy manager in one of the retail stores that I cannot disclose the name. I have three years experience in retail, one as a pharmacist and another two as a manager. In total, I have five years work experience, which includes internship, community service, I did four years honors degree, KOYU KZN. Let's see how much is she earning. Guys, that these people are getting good money. I'm telling you, these people are getting good money. Uh, okay, basic salary forty-eight thousand, and then there is another salary that is non-pensionable seven thousand nine hundred. Overtime five thousand four hundred. Another overtime fifteen thousand five hundred. Okay, this was during December period. Okay, and then there is overtime over like Sunday. 3200 holiday overtime 7100 another holiday overtime 1200 yo guys there's a lot of overtime here but i understand it's because it's it's retail and then there's something ma taxable 1500 er paid insurance 3400 provident fund 3200 total earnings for this month 88492 Deductions thirty two thousand three hundred and a net pay of fifty six thousand one hundred and eighty six. There's someone who is a pharmacy manager. All right, now let's look at two pharmacist assistants. Okay, the first one, uh, the first one, hi, Bonnie. Uh, as promised, uh, here is my pay slip of a basic pharmacist assistant in retail. We work uh, Sundays and public holidays as normal, and we don't get paid for it. How? You don't get work. You don't get sana. Aye. Okay, let's see how much she is earning. Pharmacist assistant. Salary 7944 uh, deductions 140 okay net pay of 7800 rents that's someone who is a pharmacist assistant the one thing I didn't get is the years of experience let's move to the next one are you surprised guys <laughs> Guys, like, this is an assistant. <laughs> it's not a pharmacist. <laughs> Hi, Bonnie. I saw your video on Facebook. I'm a pharmacist. Assist I'm so happy people on Facebook are contributing to this village. And I am also receiving pay slips from people from YouTube. Obviously, most, my, of, most of the pay slips, they come from TikTok. But guys, please, you can also send your slip through to my email address cover.bonisili at gmail.com but please do not send your CVs only your your pay slips okay so pharmacist assistant guys uh, I need to mention most of the time you go uhamba through e-learning leadership ne so I did ask this one as well then she said yes she well, she got in through a leadership it takes about two years to complete they normally require metric with 60% mathematics and 50% English. First year, you would become a learner basic. When you are done, you do your learner post basic. We work under a supervision of a pharmacist, obviously, but in government, the post of a basic pharmacist assistant can work on their own. However, there is a roaming pharmacist doing the visits now and again to check, okay? So, as you can see, maths, uh, maths and English are very important. And also, if you work in government, you can work by yourself. 
but there will be a pharmacist there is roaming checking if you are doing everything accordingly now let's see get baby girl how much is she earning okay this one has six years experience uh pensionable salary six, sixteen thousand eight hundred and thirty five and she mentioned that when she first started it was fourteen thousand okay non-pensionable salary three thousand two hundred sunday over time sunday pay 1.2 and then uh her total earnings twenty one thousand five hundred there's deductions and then a pay of seventeen thousand three hundred and sixty five uh, I don't know how the village feels about this one but uh, I think she's got a good deal yeah she's got a good deal and I can see the name of the combine okay they are paying her well <laughs> let's look at a qualified uh, pharmacist with five years experience okay uh, right so now this one has five years experience qualified pharmacist which me she's a pharmacist grade one okay in a woman four year degree okay basic salary forty five thousand four hundred a rural allowance five thousand four hundred and fifty eight uh NP cash nine thousand seven hundred and eighty nine total earnings sixty thousand seven hundred and thirty one deductions 28,100 and a net pay of 62,000 sorry net pay of 32,613 there's someone who's working in the eastern cape and they have five years experience now the last one is someone who works in Mpumalanga province and they have one year experience okay they also work for the department of health all right so she did mention for a degree followed by an internship to be registered as a qualified pharmacist by a professional body okay yeah then she did her community service as well hey guys buy a funda la bandune buy a funda basic salary this one is one year experience basic salary forty four thousand a rural allowance 5300 NP cash 9600 total earnings 59000 yeah 59000 total deductions 22000 and then a salary of 37161 that's a pharmacist with only one year experience guys i hope you find value please consider subscribing and do like this video it helps me a lot with the algorithm so that youtube can see that <laughs> this video is is valuable okay guys i'll see you on the next one bye bye